Hello, you all are welcome. Where we will have a conversation on Swamitva Yojana with Union Minister of Rural Development and Panchayati Raj Government of India, Shri Giriraj Singh Ji. What is Swamitva Yojana scheme and what is the objective behind its launch? See, it's a vision of our Honorable Prime Minister Narendra Modi. It's a vision of approx around 6.5 or 7 lakh villages of the country. The houses in Desi language it's called Gharori. They don't have official documents. Neither they have any systematic proper technical ownership rights. That's why our honorable PM guided directed and launched Swamitva Yojana. And today that Swamitva Yojana is bringing new revolution in the country and excitement in the rural lives. This Swamitva is not only one drone map of houses, but solid register deed of which one or two centimeter differences are there, like taking pictures, state government polishing it with lime bars, and then neighbors, and then neighbors would have different opinions and arguments on this, and then state government diagnosed that problem and then deemed registered house along with map is given to them. This is called Swamitva, which is launched on 24 April 2022 by the Honorable Prime Minister. With the scheme, what changes are coming in rural people lives presently and what is the scope of benefits of this in the future? See, it depends on the person taking benefit. Already giving directions to the bank, also in urban areas, there are proper documents of the houses of which people take loan against their property or do something. But there was no value of rural area houses before. When pictures are taken by drone, or polishing etc are done and then on the basis of both the state and central government guidelines after calculations and blending deemed technical registered certificate are given and then these people use this in new areas of their lives like taking loans or calling as the official certified house property. What efforts are being made to ensure that this scheme reaches the villages at the earliest? This Government of India in collaboration with the Survey of India, we are running its technical program with all of them. Mutual agreements are going on, they only arrange the drones. The same install the core as CORS, wherever that need to be installed. Technical, wherever they need to be put. The department says in Panchayati Raj, whatever I want. They work in proper manner quickly. Sometimes pressures are there that, sir, as soon as possible, the states with which we have signed MOU should work as soon as possible. And may this CORS bring new communication into the life of the village. What will be new communication? It will have a technology that will have an app like a mobile which will work 99% accurate by which you would be able to measure the house without any complications. There won't be a problem. If in case you need help from that CORS, also we have us that if need it in the panchayat buildings, it will help us. We get information about the weather then there will be many technical arrangements through which the rural people will have a new subculture in farming in common life. There will be new revolutionary communication. What is happening in the village today? In the village, we need drains for cleanliness. In the village, we need water from the household, in the house, from the field to in the field and from the village water in the village. So if the water from the house is in the house, then we have to pour the sock pit. So all in this, when GPDP will be created, then the planning will be ensured where is whose house and where will be sock pit and all, where will the exit of the drain be, if it needs to be electrified, though it's already been done, where the pole needs to be put. And the biggest reflection is, 
is mutual quarrels, the cases and trials in villages, in families of owning, this is mine, that is mine, it will be sorted. Swamitva is Honorable Prime Minister's flagship program. Now once I will do the process of my gharari of department, then for each one we will do, it's like a mobile number, but the Aadhaar number of that plot will be available. That means then it will be one and only number of a person. No one can change it from here to there. This will be technical and positive impact of Swamitva scheme, which will create a transparent impact, positive impact on fights in villages and for new dimensions in other areas of life. And also in upcoming future, under Modiji's direction, we are planning to initiate the same on plots like giving Adhan numbers. So likewise, we will have one side dim registered for Gharari, along with Geo Adhan number, and other side for plots also very soon altogether, and that means village and panchayat, trying their extent level of efforts to make conflict-free rural areas with full transparency. How is the Gram Panchayat is playing its role to make Swamitva Yojana scheme reach every village? Like I said before, that with state government, there is MOU. When state government accept our conditions and model, and then Survey of India initiate its work. And I keep the monitoring that at least one drone should cover 4-5 villages in a day, should complete by taking pictures and measuring and all, that what I make pressure. And by which today, we have taken around prox 2 crore parcel and covered and completed around 1.5 lakh villages. We were talking on Swamitra Yojana with Union Minister of Rural Development and Panchayati Raj Government of India, Honorable Shri Giriraj Singh Ji. We express our gratitude to him and now seek your permission. Jai Hind!